Hello, my name's Martin and welcome to Strap Chat. Uh, we're going to war. That's the plan. I've been counselled against it by Chris. He said, well, I'll try and, break the, try and break the alliance that they've got before you go for it because there are so many horse archers and I've got no counter to that. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for my, for my, holy, yeah, for my holy Warriors. I've got uh, two big alliances. I've got one minor alliance. And I've got a bit of money, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually like just take a few months to, 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 you know, to buy a few extra regiments, take a few months to allow those to build up, and then we're just going to go and do it and see what happens. Let's get into the game. Okay, right, I can't increase the size of that. I can increase the size of that. Okay. Okay, this is a this is the chap. The problem is he's at war. And he's not my direct vassal. Okay. He is. Right, if I ask him to surrender and he does, what's gonna happen? All right, do you know what? We're not going to war for a few months. Let's see what happens. But basically, my best commander is busy commanding an army at the moment, which is a bit of a pain. Just building up the armies here. Getting a little bit of money back. Right, we still need more light horsemen. So a couple of months for the light horsemen. Okay, we are at full strength. Okay, is my... Is this chap still at war? Yes, but he's about to lose. Do I wait for him? No. 721, it's the allies that we're scared of, 6,427. We're gonna to have to be on our toes for this. Okay, Duchy and Nitra, right, go for it. Okay, let's get some allies. Well, we're definitely having a King Arnulf, the child killer of Bavaria, 350 prestige, we can have you on board. King Lothair II of Italy, without, without any Really frightening nicknames. And even Count Auxilio with 600 men, why not? Right, so where are we gonna, where are we gonna summon our forces? I guess right here. And we shall raise all. And we mustn't forget to hire those, okay? Okay. Right, so his allies come in. Genghis Nisi. Let's just go for that. Okay. Uh, minus 4.4. Let's see what happens when I go for War Profit here. Oh, well, that's nice. Big difference. Okay. I really want to catch these guys if I can. And I've got the arm. Okay, I've got my commander now. I don't even know his name. Geoffrey of Moravia. Excellent, because he's a really, really good commander. Right, what am I going to do with this? Um, I can get new silver coins minted, development growth, a load of prestige. Oh, this one. 99% chance of gaining 145 gold. That feels really good. Okay, let's get these guys. I want to get them. I think I've missed my chance to catch them. Why has my alliance expired? Okay, that feels like really bad news. This is my daughter. So she is my player heir. We don't want to be fickle, not particularly trusting, so content may have to do. I can't believe we missed those guys. We should have got them. And I can't believe that one ally has already dropped out. I'm going to take some of these cities. Oh, here they come. Okay. Oh, he's died. Okay. So I'm losing my best commander just at the wrong time. Yeah, we don't want him in charge. Okay. Right, they're running away now. Okay. What is going to happen? I'm feeling quite tense. Right, that's good news. At least we captured the capital of Moravia. Right, we've got 300 of these super human horsemen things. Oops. Okay, okay, here they come. They got 7,000 of these guys. 
Right, let's join up our main army. Right, we'll take this place and then we'll go and fight them in our own territory. Right, take this city. This could so easily go wrong. That small army that escaped had 300, at least 300 horsemen. That's what we should have had. Okay. If we'd have killed those, we would be in good shape now. Right, let's wait for this, these guys to come and join me. Is that a river? No. Right, we're just going to go for it. Right, just follow me in. This is my best, best commander. Yes, unfortunately. I think I'm just tipping the scales on. That was close. That was scary. Okay. We've lost similar amounts of troops to them, but we've sent them packing. Right, let's see if we can take that before they come back. Another lot of stewardship lifestyle put. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, that'll help the war effort a little bit. Right, we, these guys need to die. What's in there? Yeah, 235. Okay. Where are they going? Right, let's head there. Looks like they're going to die anyway. I have a son. And he's intelligent, not beautiful. Right, I'm going to choose his name. Right, Devon. Strong name for a Bohemian king, I think. Right, we also need to think about educating him. Okay, so it can't be me at the moment, so let's just let's just drop a ward. Okay, so I'm educating him and he is obviously gonna get all my votes now. Devon, my friend, one day you will be king of Bohemia and probably Moravia if I win this war. There's obviously people that need it. So I think this is a really important battle because I've caught like a third of their um, horse archers in a battle that they're going to lose. Right, I've had an ally join the war. That's not great news. Um, yeah, they got 5,000. We got 12, so we should still win. And I'm going to catch these guys out. Lovely. Okay, that's a really useful victory. That's it. We've won. Right. That was much more scary than I thought it was going to be. But I did expect to catch that small group at some point. I knew he, it would take a while for his allies to come in, and I thought that small group, I, if I catch them out, I'd have the advantage. Um, missed it completely. Okay. Let's do it. I guess we look in the prisons. <coughs> I'll get 30 for her. Okay, I'm happy with that. So first thing I want is the Great Principality. I can usurp that, but it cost me 500. Okay, can I get some money off the old Pope? How close are we? I think he might think I'm too rich. It's 398. I really need this money from the Pope. Okay, let's start giving away some of these counties. Whew. Wow. Okay, they're all going to local Slovenian nobles. I mean, this is a lot of territory. For someone who's playing tall, I have just taken a lot of territory. Okay. Hmm. So actually, all of these are contributing less than they might. Yeah, tax I mean, tax income is very low, but these, these places will come back. So I think maybe if I become the Duke first, I'll be getting better from these guys. Okay, let's do that then. And also I've spent my money. I think that'll cheer up the Pope a little bit. Okay, so we're gonna usurp Duchy of Nietzsche. She's a foreign ruler anyway. Okay, gets me down to just 52. So I really need the Pope on my side here. Uh, does any of this need converting? No, it's all Catholics. We've actually saved Catholics from uh, whatever the Hungarians' uh, religion is. Okay, my level of devotion is about to go up. So I can do whatever I like because I now have only one son. He is going to inherit everything regardless of what my structure is. 
So that's kind of good news. That's kind of interesting news. Okay, I'm really keen, really interested to know what, I mean, this is promising. This is promising. Right, let's just hit play and see how things build up. Okay, right, money's back up to 13 a month. Military's back up to full strength. Got me 30 ransom. So I'm almost 20% of the way there. I am 20% of the way there. Do you know I wouldn't normally do this, but I am the Duke of this area. Let's set him down helping to build up the... Because uh, I don't not expect to go to war again, so let's put him back to sort of civilian duties, if you like. Bring back control in these areas, because they will eventually pay me a percentage of their money. Why is my sister trying to murder him? Well, me discovering it makes it less likely to happen. That's good news, isn't it? Right, let's sway her. Have we got any factions? Literally not a single faction against me. That's great news. Ah, we need a successor. Yes, this is going to be plus two. Heavy infantry. Definitely want a successor. Let's seek one. So I could probably take these bits. I mean, so I could take Tech off or Hunt. Give it to this Countess. She's one of these characters I've just created. Um, a lot of prestige, isn't it? <clears throat> and there's bits of great Moravia that I don't control. And I am going to be the Duke of it. Okay. Um, yeah, okay, I'm a little bit tempted. It's only costing me... Let's declare war on her, because if we catch her, we win straight away. We don't have to keep fighting the liege. Okay, so we want tech off. But we should be able to win this quite easily. Oh, they haven't got a hostile faith. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, 150, that's nice. Right, I do want to just check, because I've got loads of innovations. I do need to sort of work, look, just check that out. So I'm looking at, still looking at getting Ledger, which will allow me to build extra buildings. So I'm going to get that very, very soon. My new fascination is... My new exposure is quilted armour, so we'll have that in a few months. Then I think we need to be, definitely need to be getting onagers. No, we need city planning, don't we? Okay. City planning next. Right, I'm very, very happy for that 150. I might have been tempted not to go to war if I'd known that was going to happen. Are we going to catch that? Yes, good, nice, easy victory. Okay, so they've only got 1,461 soldiers, even with their allies, so I think we're all right. We're close to home. We can raise our levies here if we need to. Ah, right, okay. So this is it. We've got ledgers. So I go to somewhere like Prague. I've now got three boxes. So this time I need to finish my wars. I need to get the 500 gold and I need to get back to building. So we'll get city planning in 35 years if nothing changes. But I'm really hoping my son is into learning. Okay, so we're clearing land. Can we have the levy reduced? Yeah, we, we, we can get by without the levies. Is he coming for me? He, he is, I think. Oh, my queen is pregnant again. I mean, how old is my queen? She must be beginning to get on. She is 33. I guess she could still have quite a few children. I've got enough boys now. Ray's turned away. Okay, no, she's fine. I, I'm fine. My gold is still the same. She's only got five on. She's even weaker than the other lady. Okay, so we have got an ally just join. So there's now a thousand of them. So we're still we're still in good sh in good shape. Okay, I've got to move over here, haven't I? Okay, let's raise all of our guys. Right. Okay. I propose a patrol to my sister. Yeah, they're born into my house. I'm happy enough with that. Okay. Right. We put them together. We do that. Or we go fine. We want them slaughtered, really. This is frustrating. Okay, nothing I can do about it right now. Yep, yeah, I will avenge it. Okay, nice little victory. Let's go and take that. Okay, so I've got another boy. So he's a backup. Looks like they're leaving. That at least is... 
reassuring. I think both my armies are strong enough to stand on their own. Okay, we've won anyway. Okay, so that war was more expensive than I wanted it to be. All right, we made any progress with the Pope? No. Maybe a tiny bit. We're actually making this lady quite powerful, aren't we? Can I now attack this guy? I actually can because the person I declared war against a minute ago has died. And this is Hont, isn't it? So he's very weak. Okay, declare war. Let's give it to a different count. 375. Hang on, I've got lots of messages here. Okay. done it again. This is actually quite frustrating. Um, right, we've beaten the army, all we've got to do is take this castle, I think the war's over. Okay, so I've lost a councillor. Oh, that's Steward, he's been with me a long time. Hmm, I really need... I can discover quilted armour, that's interesting. Okay, so what is my new... Yeah, I don't think I've got one yet. Yeah, so this castle is slow. It's level four, so it'll it'll fall. Oh, where's he raiding now? I'll tell you what, he's gonna he's gonna suffer for this. Here's a king. Let's accept that. Okay, this is about to fall. Excellent. Okay, so we've expanded into most of the space available. Into most of Greater Moravia. Nice. Now we just need the Pope to come through and we're absolutely laughing. Okay, the last bit then of my duchy is this bit over here. It looks like a ind small independent kingdom. Loads of alliances, but they're not that strong. Okay, okay we wait till we get to full strength and I think we'll just take that. Okay. So we've used up a lot of our prestige, but we are basically going to be back in control. We're going to be in control of the whole of Moravia and Bohemia. I mean, the grateful free folk, it's a popular opinion. I'd rather have the control. This is my last war. It's interesting. Got a massive raiding army. Okay, this is perfect. So this is my play around sun. He's just got pensive. They're raiding my new territory, so I'm kind of going to accept that for now, on the grounds that there's nothing I can do about it. Brief battle. We're extorting subjects 100%. So when this war is over, we're going to become the king of Greater Moravia. 270? 400. Go for that. Deal with the other problems. Easy victories. Let's, let's do the Great Moravia thing now. Okay. Okay, you, sir. Okay, so I'm now the king of two kingdoms. The only problem is because I've got two sons, I lose one of them, won't I? Right, we'll need to work that out. Okay, we've won. Okay. Super. Okay, so if we look at my duchies, so I control all of Nitra all of Bohemia. Moravia is in the hands of um, is she my duchess? Yeah. This, uh, this, this lady here. Excellent. I've got lots of money I can start investing. Okay. Let's do that. Let's have a look in Prague. I think we get rid of the pikemen and we build these. Look at these. We can have these up as high as nine. Okay. So we build a barracks. We'll disband these, create, ooh, retinue vanguard, 32, 22, 45, 35. There we go. I will station them in Prague. I think I'm kind of happy with that. Right, money should go up as soon as the army's back at full strength, which will be a while now, or we're being raided again. See, I can't do anything about, I can't stop this. I can't believe we got another child. All right, I've now got three sons. And she's only 31, there's no reason why we can't have more. Would this work? 
if for the Kingdom of Bohemia, I had feudal elective and controlled every single county, I can always elect whoever I want as my, as to inherit all of that. And then I change my primary title to Moravia. Does that work? I think it does work. I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't be able to keep hold of the duchy. Just the kingdom title. But that's okay. Okay, right, so we need one and a half thousand prestige. It's been nice to have university here one day. So we're already at development 19. Yes, we need public works as well, really. <coughs> what I think I might do is when I get to 20, I might go and do some of the others. So she is 13, so she would eventually be married to a king. I just never expected my queen to, to give me three sons. I thought I'd never get a son. Okay, so he's finished there, which is brilliant news. Let's do up there. Just undoing the damage of those raids. Right, we've got a wooden barracks built. Okay, what else can we build in Prague? Okay, kind of nothing. Okay, so that weird thing we had about tribal county or something has gone missing. So that's good, that's gone. So the only reason we can't know is city planning. And city planning we're working on, and I think we're going to get that in about, about 30 years. 15 years, okay. All right, why are we still in stewardship? We don't need divided attention. Let's change to that. Ooh. Okay, that was possibly a mistake. I didn't even think about that. Ah. This is my weakest county. 1.2.9.6 in Boleslav, but that's only because it's it's actually quite good. Radic. Okay, let's give away Radic to the oldest person I can find. Okay. okay how's my son getting on? Good. Okay, so we can, we can build stuff all over the place. So let's, <coughs> let's do that. Manor houses as well as farms. So we can do that. That's great news. So we want to see this accelerate. This income growth really kind of beginning to accelerate. Okay, he's finished that. That's lovely. So increase control in Boleslav. Ah, it's my archbishop. Okay. Oh, he's much better. He's much better. Okay, that's nice. So I'm kind of assuming now that we're going to get this less than 15 years. 14. Well, wow. we're about to reach 20 development in Prague. Yeah, good luck with that. I'm not interested in any territorial expansion. No, I'm not joining anything. We're just going to we just want to build up, do a bit of catching up. After all those wars, very costly. Okay, right. Looks like we've virtually undone the damage of those wars. Um, now, I'm the count of the all of this, the duke of all of this. So I'm going to start helping to increase the um, control. And we go down to the bottom where these guys are. Yeah, they're not giving me much. Some of them are. She's giving me four, one. It's all coming up. It's all coming up. That's the key thing here. I'm 33. I'm still quite young. Okay, we've done it. We're at 20. Okay, so let's get the steward. <coughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, it's going to be going so much quicker because my development is, is already low. Look at that. It's only going down 10% because of the hills. I probably should be doing Zatek or something, but be nice to see all these places going up to 20. I mean, hunting ground gives you a little bit more defender advantage, but it's just got the, like, the biggest one. 1.3 is pretty much the same, isn't it? Let's construct that one. Okay, I'm living with him. So that's going to be helping my money a lot, I think, if I just keep doing this. Let's do Haunt. He's giving me 0 0.1. And it's at virtually zero, isn't it? It's on control of two. Okay. Bring that up and I'll be getting a decent amount of money out of it. Right, do you know what I might do is go on a pilgrimage. I mean, he's getting closer to offering it to me. Right, let's save up for a pilgrimage. We were always going to be quite a religious ruler. No! 
I've got another son. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Okay. Right. We're going to have to try our way out. I think we've got a way out. We're going to have to try it. So she's going to go and get married, and that's going to increase my renown. When we get to one and a half thousand, we're going to see if my plan works. There's a possibility of losing one son. Um, <clears throat> okay, Vikings have gone. Huh. Right, we're nearly, nearly there. Okay, this is this is going to be interesting. Okay, so let's 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 test this. So at the moment, it is going to take me twelve years. What difference does it make when I go for science? <coughs> I think I think not a massive difference. I think that just speeds up how you get all the other ones. It's taking a year off though. Okay. So this is the plan. I've got two kingdoms. At the moment, I'm only losing two titles, but one of them is a kingdom title and the duchy title, which is big. I'm working on making this duchy title quite valuable to me. <coughs> so what do we do? And make this my primary. Okay, so I think I'm still losing two. Right. Right, now what we do is we go to Bohemia, the kingdom title. We add a law, feudal elective, and we elect my oldest son. Player Aaron's son. He's the one that's not well actually. <coughs> And now let's see what's happening. I'm losing the Duchy of Nitra. I don't think there's anything I can do to avoid that. But that's the only thing I'm losing now is the Duchy of Nitra. Right, let's just see how poorly my son is. He's ill. Let's have a look at my second son. Actually, let's give him an education focus. That one. So I'm sorry, Devon. <laughs> right. 
let's give him stewardship focus. And he's being educated. Okay. So is there any way I can stop losing the Duchy of Moravia? I don't think there is. No, I don't think there is. But that's okay, because like, if everything goes to plan, my son gets better. <coughs> he inherits nearly everything except the Duchy of Moravia. His brother gets that. Um, we will have built this up so that it's generating quite a lot of money, which they will play to my brother, and he'll pay a proportion of that to my heir. So I think that's okay, isn't it? Right, so we're, so we're building things nearly everywhere. I tell you what, let's save up money. Holy Order's expanded, which is great. I think we save up some money so we can build some uh, baronies in 12 years, 10 years time. Okay, how are we doing with her? Right, she's at 100%, okay. Let's get her to 100%. All right, we'll get him up a little bit higher. And we're saving up for pilgrimage. I'm gonna go to Jerusalem. It's late, I'm tucking into a gripping tree ties on classical grammar, of course I am, and just as I start giggling at some delightfully snide marginalia left by the previous reader, my wife enters the room. Spineless man, you neglect everything but your studies. Reading indoors, alone, from dusk to dawn, get your head out of those dusty scrolls, or don't come to my bed tonight. Well, that's not a bad idea, as you wish. I gain alluring confidence, which is increasing my fertility. No. Okay, learning is increased, so this is where I just... I have to learn more late, right? Learning is increased. Right, so I won't lay with you. I have a warm embrace of knowledge. Well, this one seems the best one. Okay, so Prince Devon gets a better... Right, Devon, you've just got better educated. I like that. We're certainly building up a little bit of, of renown. But everyone is trying to murder everybody. What is my... Yeah, she's... She should be on disrupt schemes. Right, yeah, we'll have ten of you. Okay. Right, so I'm going to uh, I'm going to stop there. Uh, basically, I'm really happy with the way that the, the succession thing has gone. The only thing is, I don't get to choose who it is that gets the Duchy of uh, Nitra, which is kind of key because of all the money coming up through it. And it may very well be that um, you know because it, it's going to be my 
second, el- you know, my brother, my, uh, well, my current leader's second son. So what I think I might do is give that to the right person, somebody I actually want to have it. Um, but then that seems silly because I'm not benefiting from being the Duke in my own lifetime. Mm, yeah, maybe we just let it go to the sun. The point is that the, all we're losing is that duchy, and it's going to be it's going to involve a small decrease in income, and we can live with that. Okay, we can accept that. <coughs> Everything else is staying. We keep the duchy of uh, Bohemia and the kingdom of Bohemia, and own every single county there in, in its entirety, which is which is fantastic. Development is, is going up, so at the moment I'm working on bringing everybody up to 20 because I don't want to be fighting that 20 ceiling. So when we get, is it city? It's not city planning, is it? When we get whatever the innovation is which allows us to go above, I'll go back to focusing on Prague. But if I can get everybody in that ring, in that little donut around Prague to, to have very, very high um, development, then we're going to really, really be getting innovations very, very quickly. My son, my heir, if he lives, because he hasn't been well at all, but if he does, he's going to be a very, very good stewardship slash learning ruler. So that's exciting. Okay, His education is going very, very well, even if um, his health seems to be suffering a little bit. If failing that, I've got a backup son who's very, very good at stewardship. So, you know, that's not the end of the world, I suppose. When we come back on Monday, we're going to be going on a pilgrimage because we really, really want to get the Pope back on side. I mean, I mean, we are a paragon of virtue. Religious icon is the next one up. We should be getting loads and loads of money off the Pope. We're just not. So um, we'll try that. And we're looking for ways really to ingratiate ourselves with him and just improve our, his opinion of us. Um, they've definitely nerfed that. It's much, much more difficult to get just you know tons and tons of gold from the Pope that's probably not a bad thing force you to kind of like work for it a little bit um, but there we are that's where we're going to end um, thank you very 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 much for watching hope you've enjoyed it uh, on Monday we're back with of course the pilgrimage we'll be doing that almost straight away have a nice weekend and until then take care bye bye